Yeah, everybody, and welcome back to my Let's Play of Pokemon X and Y. Uh, last episode, we just did the basic kind of um, do our own thing, and now we're actually going to... Um, actually, yeah, there's Chester, the Chespin. Let me just look a summary. Summary! Summary! Yeah, there's Chester, the Chespin. Um, I know, pretty basic, but that's okay. We're going to continue on to this little area. And it looks like we found our first little Pokemon. What is it? Ah, it's a Pidgey. Sweet. Go, Chester. See, I don't really see ourselves catching a Pidgey. So, um, Pidgey's not going to be on my team. I've actually seen Pidgey uh, on my own playthrough. Um, so, I've been kind of messing with that a little bit. But, here we go. Um, what every Pokemon game has. Oh, hi, Tango. Come learn how to catch Pokemon with me. Serena's mom and dad are amazing trainers. That's why she knows so much about catching Pokemon and battling. Well, mom and dad may be good, but that has nothing to do with me. Okay, now watch carefully, you two. All right, so this is a basic tutorial of how to catch a Pokemon. All right. As you, as you know, you have to weaken your Pokemon first, and then you'll have to actually, um, you know, lure it. Alright, and then she's going to throw the Pokeball. As you see, she caught the Pokemon. Um, all right, the Pokemon went inside the Pokeball. All right, what do you think for Froki, or what do you think Froki's inside right now? Here, I'll show some Pokeballs with you. So I guess we didn't really need to buy any of them, but it's all right, we can never have enough. All right, Pokeballs, do you think I can catch Pokemon with them too? Sure, you can catch the Pokemon around here just by throwing a Pokeball near them. All right, I'll find a cute Pokemon, I'll throw lots of Pokeballs at it, and then we'll become friends. All right, when you catch wild Pokemon, it makes your Pokemon stronger too. Yeah, that's something that they added to it. I don't know if you guys know, um, but if you guys capture a Pokemon, the um, you actually gain experience for the capture as well. Normally, you don't. Um, but as you see, we're going to go through our second battle. All right, younger, uh, or Youngster Austin. Zigzagoon. So you even have some, uh, I believe this is Gen 3, not Gen 3, Gen 4. Um, yeah, Zigzagoon. Let's see. Just add it. Oh, yeah. So I was about to say, I'm going to skip this battle. But um, one, I can't make it fast forward. And another, I can't skip it. I was going to run away. All right. Let's see. Yeah, but I've been really tired. I'm actually, I just got off work. Um, selling Pokemon and now I'm actually getting to play it. I've played it played it on my lunch break um, so I'm a little bit farther in my, my personal playthrough as I level up to level 7. Excellent. Oh. Alright, we defeated Youngster Austin. You should have told me you were that strong. Well, why would I tell you I'm that strong? Because I'm a beast! Alright. Alright going on wait up let's walk together i feel like something exciting will happen if i stay by you i'll hear your pokemon whenever you want me to sure and as you see these items are kind of more three-dimensional like and he actually bends down and picks up the item which is that it's actually really fun or really good um but some of the pokemon you can catch in this area you can catch a lot of pokemon in this area there's a weedle um weedle's not going to be a part of my team so i'm just going to run away See, I honestly don't know who's going to be on my team. Uh, I'm still kind of experiencing who I can catch right now. Um, all right, this lead. Okay, whatever. All right, uh, but there's an item over here. There's an antidote. Um, but I'm still kind of experiencing what Pokemon I can catch. Um, and I'm not really sure what I can catch yet. I know some Pokemon that, I'm, that I can catch. Um... There's a Scatterbug. That's kind of like the Caterpie version of this uh, this generation. But Scatterbug's not going to be on my team. Alright, found a potion. 
I don't have any repels, so I can't use those either. But we're going to have a lot of this going on. I'm going to try to avoid it, but I think there might be an item over here somewhere. I'm not sure. There's a uh, pants here, so you can have catch the... Uh, I know you can catch the three monkeys here. So pants here, pan poor, and pan sage. You can all catch here. Uh, but I'm not going to catch a pants here. All right. All right, I'm back where I am. Okay. All right. All right, if our Pokemon are weak, uh, they're just talking about battling. And uh, she's actually going to get us an item. And I believe it's a Paralyze Heal. Yes, it's a Paralyze Heal. Excellent. All right, got that. All right, got our second battle going. All right, come on, Scatterbug. Let's powder this punk. I'm not a punk. You're a punk. All right, Youngster Drake. Hopefully, I, I decide on at least one Pokemon. And then I kind of, I guess I'll go from there. All right. I have an idea of somebody I want. But I'm not really sure if I want him yet. All right. Come on, tackle. Right. Scatterbug is gone. Fletchling. If you knew any uh, flying attacks, I'd be afraid of it. Um, but it doesn't really, so I'm not really worried about it. Alright, Growl. I think in this episode we'll get to right before the gym. Um, but then the next episode we will actually uh, challenge the gym leader. Excellent. Alright, well you're going to see uh, two... Two, um... What is it? Two, uh, two black screens on the uh, thing. And I learned roll out. Um, you're going to see two black screens... Alright, uh, cheer up Scatterbug, we lost this time, but we'll get the next one who comes along for sure. Alright, uh, like I said, um, two screens, one's gonna, or two, you're gonna see a black little thing on the bottom, and then on the right, and then first episode you saw on the right is, um, the Pokemon that I've caught. So, um, Pokemon that I've, that I, are on my team will be on the right side, and on the bottom, I think I'll do badges. So the Pokemon, or the badges that I've attained in that area. And those will uh, obviously update uh, periodically when I, obviously I get more Pokemon and all that kind of stuff. Uh, there's a Caterpie, so you can catch Caterpie and Weedle. I feel like at first uh, Caterpie and Weedle were uh, exclusive to their uh, certain versions. Because I haven't found a Weedle yet in, the, um, in my own playthrough for it. Alright, uh, your Pokemon are in for a shock. And if you could guess what that means, that means there is a Pikachu. Pikachu's so awesome. Alright. Uh, we're gonna... I didn't want to roll out. Oops. Pikachu's like the only one that actually has its, uh, its pride. Stop doing it, Pikachu. Yeah, it's pretty much gone now. Alright. Level up. Excellent. Alright, I defeated last. I was the one who got shocked. Ha 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 ha. Funny. Not really. Uh, let's continue. See if we find any Pokemon that kind of interests me. Caterpie? No, not really. See, I kind of thought about doing a Nuzlocke for it. 
Um, but I don't know how difficult these trainers are, and I feel like I might go in there blind thinking that I have it, and then I die, and then game over, and I can't do it anymore. Alright, the best part about Pokemon battles is that they can happen anytime, if anyone, and anywhere. We got Last Lease. Bringing out Weedle. Forget Weedle. I got Chester. And now that I know Rollout, that's super effective against bug types. I am gone. Oko. Alright, Bunnelby is one of the new Pokemons. It looks pretty cool. I thought about it, but then I was like, eh, it's a normal type. I don't really see anything. I don't see me getting anything out of a Bunnelby. Although I probably had a good name for it. Oh well, it's whatever. Not really. I didn't really have a good name for it. It's whatever. Alright, um... Actually, I guess I did. Alright, I've got to keep battling and training up my really awesome team. Your team wasn't that awesome because you got defeated. Alright, there's a Pokeball right there. Alright, I'm actually going to talk to her. Heal us up. Thank you. Yeah, she'll heal you up uh, periodically. I really want to catch a Pikachu. That's, yeah, that's nice. Alright, there's a potion right there. There's a scatterbug. I don't want a scatterbug. The pan sage. So as as I said, you can catch the uh, elemental monkeys. Alright, so you're the first to arrive. Looks like my new neighbor is someone f with a lot of potential. Alright, the way Pokemon move, it's just incredible. I want to show off some of that spirit when I dance. Tierno, how could you think about something besides how Pokemon move for once? Alright, we're all here. Let's go to Santa Loom City. We're going together! Apologize, hold on a second. Sending a message. Alright, uh, what are you all going to do? I look for Pokemon, of course. The professor did ask us to complete the Pokedex after all. This is true. And furthermore, different Pokemon prefer living in different places. This is also true. To put it another way, it's a chance to find different Pokemon than the ones in the forest. I'll bet different Pokemon will use different moves. I sure want to see a lot of moves. Alright, what are you going to do, Serena? I'm going to Santa Loom City's gym and challenge the gym leader. Alright, uh, Pokemon trainers, find out how good they are by challenging the leaders in Pokemon gyms. Wow, you know, sure, or you sure know a lot. It's because mom and dad taught me so much. Here I have something for you guys, adventure rules. Uh, ten different tips. Alright, we're getting one. I guess we'll look at it. If you're puzzled, alright. All right, bags, let's find the key items. Adventure rules, what you got? All right, adventure one, open the menu with the X button. Two, record your progress with save. Three, throw Pokeballs to catch Pokemon. Four, weaken Pokemon you want to catch. Five, use battles to help your Pokemon grow. Six, heal your Pokemon at Pokemon centers. Seven. Buy more items than you think you need. 8. Talk to everyone you meet for information. 9. When you get lost, check your town map. And 10. Enjoy your journey with your Pokemon. So those are the 10 basic little rules or adventure tips. Alright, Mommy told me that I should battle anyone who greets me. I didn't greet you, you greeted me. Alright, Preschooler Oliver. Caterpie. Welcome, Caterpie. 
You're going to lose. Chester. See, and I could use the, um, I guess the mystery gift torchic that everybody's going to get. But then, then with uh, me getting the Kanto starter and torchic and, and my, um, the Kalo starter, I, I just think it's better if I just not do it. I'll get them, but I won't, uh, I won't have them on my team. And I guess if you guys want a video of how, how to do that, just let me know and I'll, I'll show you guys really easy or how quick it is. All right, roll out again. Gone, over, finished. Sorry, is you real? All right, mommy told me to be polite, especially when I lose. Well, that's not nice. All right, next one. Pokemon battles are really hard. I just let Pichu do what it wants. All right, here's Gorilla. Send out Pichu. Alright, grew to level 10. Alright, I defeated Preschool Ella. Alright, hold on. Alright. Oh, coming through. Watch out. All right. We have like two more battles before we get to the city. Hey, my Pokemon and I are studying. Want to join us? No. All right, you challenged by schoolgirl Bridget. So not be doof. Go, Chester. I mean, so far, Chester hasn't had any issues with any of these Pokemon. I don't see him having any issues with these Pokemon. Alrighty then. But, I mean, so far from what I've played, I've really liked it. There's really not much that I don't like about this game. So, um, the Pokemon, Pokemon did really well this year. Alright, just stunning isn't enough. I need to practice with real battles. Alright, there is an item right here. It is the... Super Potion. Super Potion would come in handy, but uh, Chespin is doing really well, so I don't have to worry about it. Ah, oh, sweet, a Pikachu. I didn't know you could catch a Pikachu this early. I want it. I want a Pikachu. I'm going to catch a Pikachu. Hopefully I don't take it out. Okay, I don't take it out. Excellent. I'm going to have a Pikachu. See, I never really had a Pikachu, other than Yellow. Yellow was like the only exception, but I never really caught one. One, two, three. No! I didn't catch it. Pikachu, you need to be on my team. I don't know what I'm going to nickname it, though. One, two, three. No! Get in the Pokeball! It just doesn't want to be on my team. I'm guessing that's what it is. Two, three, one more. Yeah! We got a Pikachu! Woo! Alright, what am I going to nickname this Pikachu? As you see, this is what it looks like every time you catch Pokemon. 
So Pikachu it raises its tail to check its surroundings. The tail is sometimes struck by lightning in it in this pose. Alright, give a nickname. We have to have a nickname. Oh, what am I gonna call this Pikachu? Um See I kinda wanna call it Sparky for because um we called it or one of the uh, old trainers called it Sparky. But I don't want to use that. Um, what do I want to use? Um, Alright, I'm going to call him Mickey Mouse. All right, Mickey Mouse. All righty. So we got Mickey Mouse, the Pikachu. I'm going to battle one more. All right, the best way to learn a move is to have your Pokemon use it. All right, Schoolboy Brighton. Hand Sage. Right, we got Chester. I don't know where uh, Pikachu is as far as leveling goes. Uh, he doesn't have much uh, HP. That's what I meant, HP. We'll probably just roll out until we win. Play nice. I'm getting a phone call, but at the same time, I don't have, I don't have the time for it at the moment. I'm almost done with this episode, level 11. And I'm about to learn Bite. Excellent. So I'm actually learning a lot of cool moves. Forget uh, Growl. Alright. Forgot Growl and learn Bite. Excellent. Alright, Pants here. No, don't switch. And there's actually a setting to where you can change that. You can turn that off. Hold on. Stop calling. I'm almost done. Hand pour. Keep battling. Alright, we finished that. Alright, wow, that move packs a punch, alright. That was a one move. Alright, I think that's it. I don't think we... No, we don't have any more trainers. Alright. Alright, but we're going to stop right here uh, in Santaloon City. And we will challenge the gym leader next episode. Don't forget to leave that like, comment, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And we'll see you guys next time. This is Tango saying peace!